Oh, what he said? Okay. He said, "Ah, really, live? Yeah? Question mark. Thank you. You're super attractive as well. I'm super attractive as well. Hey y'all, it's Destiny. So Liv decided to do a TikTok live and she was waxing her mustache. She was also doing her eyebrows and she was texting a new man. She said she met this man at the gym. And of course, he got her number right away. So while Stella takes care of her youngest children, she decides to get on here and wax her mustache and text this new man. And guess what y'all? She actually got AJ a new haircut. So after neglecting Robin's hair for 30 days, she actually went to get AJ a haircut. That's very interesting. I wonder how many men at the barbershop got her number. So if you're ready to see this TikTok live, go ahead and hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button if you are new. And don't forget to hit that post notification bell so you are notified every single time I post. No, 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 He didn't text me back, you guys. That's so embarrassing. Put your pillow down. No, not over there. Right here. That is so embarrassing. They're acting like you're one. Maybe he fell asleep. Oh my God, Crystal, I hope he did. <laughs> no, I think he said he was about to take a shower. Thank you. You're welcome. Oh my God, how embarrassing. Maybe he fell asleep. <laughs> I love seeing the little hairs. Uh-uh, give me my remote, AJ. Give me my remote. Ooh! He's so well-mannered. Who, AJ? Are you talking about my son? Are you sure you're talking about my son? Oh, you, you oh you trying to put your shell? Oh, okay, my son is so smart. Y'all, he don't put Disney Plus on. Let me see, Papa. You want me to put a show on for you? He wants to lay in here. He wants to be with me. Look at my. <laughs> Come here. I want to put a show on for you. What do you want to watch, Papa? Turn it down though, because I don't want to hear that. Yes. I got my waxer, I believe, Mommy from Amazon. Mommy that Elmo. Oh! Mommy that Elmo. He responded, yeah. Mommy that Elmo. With a very nice response. Mommy that Elmo. After this, whatever. I already knew it. Like, you're so like. Ugh. Can you be like a little aggressive, please? Like, <laughs> I'm hold on. Dang, you have to give it a minute. She'll cry, baby, but. No, no, it's time to wind down. It's not time to be listening to not like us. Okay, well, what do you want to watch? Coco Melon? What? Nyahos. What the heck are you talking about? No, no music. No music right now. It's 11 o'clock. It's 11 o'clock. You're not listening to music. Okay, you can go cry to Grandma. Go ahead. Go tell Grandma. I'll put Elmo on. When you do come back, you'll watch it. Sorry. It's not a jam out time. We already jammed out. He can come back and watch his Elmo. I put Elmo on for you. Off topic. What's your new laundry combo? What do you mean laundry combo? What are you talking about, girl?
Oh, what he said. Okay. He said, uh, really live? Yeah? Question mark. Thank you. You're super attractive as well. I'm super attractive as well. What the f do I say to that? Thanks. He said, I'm going to go tell my grandma. Yes. Not Yeah, yes. That's how he is. Because my mother gives him his way for everything. He's spoiled. He's extremely... All my kids are like this, though, with their grandma. Because my mom spoils all of them. And that's fine. That's one relationship I'm not going to come in between. My mother and her grandkids. She can do whatever she wants. But when he's getting on your nerves, don't be trying to come tell me nothing. Because you have to be a certain way with them in order for him to, like, get it together. You know what I mean? But it's okay. I'm going to get AJ together when my mother leaves. He's going to get all the way together. Okay? He's going to get all the way together. Say, thank you. I appreciate it. Okay. Thank you. I appreciate it. Ew. That sounds like so... I mean, no offense to you. I'm not saying ew like what you said. But, like, just, like, ew. Like... How dry. Whatever. I guess this is... Thank you. I appreciate it. I'll put... Whatever. I'll put a little person with smiley faces. I mean, with hearts. AJ, come here. No, he wants to watch. He wants to listen to music. I told him no. He can watch this. Oh, you can watch that, baby. No, no music right now. It's too late. You have your own heat seat and your own, your own headphones. Yes, you do. Ask him how his night is going? No. I'm not asking him nothing else. He's going to have to pursue me from now on. That's it. We're done. I told him he's cute. He has his little door open. If he wants to keep opening the door, that's up to him. It's cracked. I cracked it for him. Now he knows I'm into him. But she already knew. When we were talking. No, mommy can't, mommy can't do it. She can't put it on. You know? No, I can't put it on. You're not listening to music right now. I said no. She can't put it on. So come on. Mom, you can bring me Kailani and go lay down with him. Okay, you ready to go night night? Yeah, it's night night time. Okay, we're going to go night night. How are you going to have Kailani and you're doing that? I can hold Kailani while I do this. I, I've done it before. Yeah, no, I'm not going to. No more. I already told him I'm into him. That's all the confirmation he needed. But when we were talking... You guys, come on now, we're grown. We can just tell when somebody's into us. I could tell at the gym he was into me. I could tell. Because he kept talking to me. He kept, like, trying to, like, start up conversation. So I'm like, but I thought he was married because he had that ring on his finger. So I was like, oh. But he's not married. Look, that didn't dry all the way. Um, I have the gel, I mean, I have the wax right here. It actually came with the kit, y'all. The wax came with the kit. I'll look it up, and I'll, I'll find it for y'all. It came with the kit, so it's pretty good. It's pretty bomb. watching Elmo for no reason. Thank you guys for following me.
following you since YouTube. It's crazy how much has changed, girl. Yep, so much has changed. So much. And then when you tweeze after you wax, like it doesn't hurt and the hairs just like fall out because I feel like you're already pulling at them. Fucking kids outside. I swear, man, teenagers are so annoying. I can't stand them. I know a bitch who fucked her ex-husband's sister's son, teenage underage son. I can't stand teenagers. Trying to strike a chord and it's probably a minor. They not like us. I be telling these teenagers off all the time. Thank you, Crystal. Thank you, baby. W Crystal in the chat, y'all. I'm a new mom. How do you find, how do you find time for mommy self-care? Hey, 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 No, you can't do it. Yeah, oh, mommy. Dang, I did not call all y'all. Get out of the thing, yes, get your shoes. I'm gonna zip it. Yeah, you can zip it. Yeah, you can zip it. Yeah, you can zip it. Dang, I said, get out of here. Get, don't touch the toilet. Oh, you can't. Shit is annoying as fuck. Anyway, sorry y'all. I don't want to hear it. Get out. Out. Go tell grandma. I don't want to hear it. Goodbye. Get out. It did get out. Robert Ryan, get out. Right. I've been having my wake up call. I already know. I'm about to beat these kids out. Hold on a second. I'm about to beat your butt. Girl, well, right now, my mom is staying with me. But even when my mom leaves, like, I'm going to always do self care. So my mom makes it. Oh, thank you, Max, for subscribing, for renewing your subscription. Thank you, baby. Um, my mom definitely does her big one for me. She she helps me a lot. But um, when she leaves, I'm still gonna find time. You just gotta find time, you guys. You gotta you have to prioritize yourself. Ask me that like in a couple weeks though. When my mom's gone, ask me that question. But I'm sure I'm gonna find time for it regardless. Cause self care is important to me. Super important. It's really important that we prioritize ourselves too. Of course, our kids always come first. Of course, but. AJ. Oh my god, he's so. He's gonna keep crying like this. I'm gonna go ahead and get off live, you guys, because he usually whines for like half an hour before he goes to bed. I don't want you guys hearing him whining. I have so many grays. I have to dye my hair. AJ, chill out. A cry baby with my mom. Damn, I have so many grays. It's not even worth picking them at this point. I'm just gonna dye my hair. I'm gonna dye it next week. So I'm gonna do. We're gonna be freshly black next week, honey. And then I think I'll straighten it. No, I'm not gonna straighten it. God, I don't wanna straighten it so bad. Gray hair is beautiful. It is beautiful. It definitely is beautiful, but y'all, I'm not ready to be gray yet. I'm not ready. Great, but when I am ready though, like whenever I feel like I want my, my hairs to grow, I'm gonna let them grow. 
I think that's cute when women let their hair, their gray hairs grow and they're like all gray. Like that's that's cute. And then they'd be styling it and shit. That's real cute. That will be me one day, but not not yet. I'm too young. Let me be in my thirties, okay? Your thirties are like your new twenties. Did you guys hear that before? I feel like um, cause I feel even better than I did in my forties. I mean my thirties. I mean my twenties. <laughs> I can't even talk. I feel even better now than I did in my twenties. I said my forties, bitch. I'm not even forty yet. I shouldn't have told old boy he was cute. <laughs> now I regret it. Oh well. <laughs> she almost said she's gonna give him a spanking. She said, No, we're not saying nothing that the kids told us. Not at all. We would never put them in jeopardy with that. Turn belt, it down. With the belt swinging father. No way. Turn it down. He's back in the slave days. He's back in the slave days. My mom doesn't play about the slave shit either, and she doesn't like the fact that people were whooped, okay? So she does think that's very slavish to whoop your kids with belts. Robin, turn around. What the hell is wrong with you? I'm about to beat you. No, she's not. All right, I think my mustache is gone. Bye bye mustache, no more for you. But listen y'all, I love y'all so much. I'm gonna go. Shout out to Crystal, shout out to all my gifters. I love you ladies so much. We're gonna be doing this TikTok thing every night. I'm so serious, like we are gonna be some TikTokers. TikTok, you don't stop, huh, AJ? Stop. I love you guys so very much. You know how like everybody knows us on YouTube. Everyone's gonna know us on TikTok too. Everybody, everybody gonna know us on TikTok. Just give me a little bit of time. I know I said this before, <laughs> but for real. <laughs> but I love you guys so much. Oh, <laughs> I'll make sure my baby gets to bed because he needs to go to bed. AJ, you need to go to bed. No. Yes. 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 You gotta take your butt to bed, AJ. Okay. 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 Yeah, mommy cannot do you, honey. Don't ever think you can come and challenge your mother. I'm gonna get every single little speck of hair. Honestly, after you wax it, tweezing feels good. Stop it. I don't know why. You think you can challenge your mother? Mother knows best. Give it to your mumsy. I, I there. I have like no more hairs to grab. I'm just like grabbing at skin now. Ew! You are so dry, sir. Get off my phone. Okay. We'll just keep it business from now on, okay? Do you have a tattoo inside your mouth? No. I'm just gonna keep it business, cause he's boring. He's not giving me aggression. I need aggressiveness. In the door. I have a ride. Just go over there. Just go. Did you? You just sprayed me? She just sprayed me. With 
bleach. She just, she just get sprayed out, me out with bleach, get and she's grabbing house. me. Get out of my house! Stop it! You just pushed me. Get out of my house! Did you just push me? Get out of me? my house! Oh, nobody's pushing me. Yeah, she's going to jail, and she's definitely not getting her kid. He's not aggressive. Is that how Aquarius's are? They're just like... I already told him how old I am. What the fuck? He forgot? Oh, I forgot how old he was. I think he said 42. 41. Did that man look 41? That man did not look in his 40s. I thought he was like 33. He looks good. I'm gonna fuck with him. I'm gonna say I'm 18. <laughs> no, I'm just like I'm trying to lie. I say I look like a minor. I think I do not look like no fucking minor. Yeah, I have to do my eyebrows. Maybe that's why he's asking me how old I am. Yeah, <laughs> he said. Yeah. He said yes. <laughs> open the door. AJ, open the door right now. What? Come in. I can't. You have to open the door. Unlock the door, AJ. No, mommy. Unlock it. <laughs> he said yes. <laughs> oh my God, AJ. You can unlock it. Unlock it the same way you locked it. Okay, bye. I knew his butt was gonna lock that damn door. <laughs> Come on, AJ, let's go! <laughs> yeah, you can just unlock it with that thing. He knows how to unlock the door, though. <coughs> What's in your mouth? <coughs> What's in your mouth? Take it out. Paper. <laughs> You're okay. You can't lock the doors. <laughs> if you lock the doors, then sometimes it's hard to open it. <laughs> oh my god, Izzy. No, don't give him a lollipop. He does not need a lollipop right now. And there she goes, giving him a lollipop. You're texting, you got a toddler locking doors Mommy, and a baby pop. screaming on the bed. Mommy, Too much pop. going on, girl. Mommy, baby My pop. baby's screaming on the bed. You don't even know. Mommy, baby I know. You don't even know where the fuck my baby is. What are you talking about? Can you see inside my apartment or something? You know where my baby is? That's creepy. Number one. Number two. 
Yeah, toddlers lock doors. That's what toddlers do. I don't know if you've ever had a kid. You sound like you have never had a child because you sound stupid. Um, but okay. Yeah, he locked a door, and he and we opened the door. Get out. <laughs> and now he has a lollipop. So, go ahead and call the police. Make a report. I got too much going on. No, I don't. You bitches always try to make some shit out of nothing. Nothing's happening. Like I'm, like I'm chilling, doing my eyebrows, and you worried about everything other than me doing my eyebrows. Stop worried about. Stop worrying on. Stop worrying what's going on in my background. Cause I that shit ain't got nothing to do with you. So yeah. You know, mind your business type shit. Yeah. Mind your business. You know, if you worry too much and you like stress out about everything your kid does, you're gonna be like always stressing and worrying. Just let your kid be a kid. He's chilling. And he's not dumb, so sometimes he locks doors. Mm -hmm. Get up. He's not an idiot. Get up. I wish his ass didn't know how to lock the damn door is what he does. Get up. Bobby Pops. Are you going out tomorrow night? Not tonight. Real talk. Hey, Dr. Kimberly. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I mean, it's real life. What the fuck? You want me to be like, I don't know. It's real life, but like, it's not like, it's real life. And like, you know, like, my kids are like being locked in rooms purposely and, you know, breaking windows and. No, it's nothing crazy like that. Like, but AJ might run in a room and lock the door, yeah. Or he might start crying because he's a fucking crybaby. That's just how it goes. But it's nothing like crazy, you know. I don't think it's crazy. I've seen way crazier. But I don't know. And I fucked up my eyebrow. <laughs> Oh, my Guys. Ew, this one's all round and ugly. Gross. I hate you, eyebrow. Okay, wait. I think I just fixed it. Hold on, girl. Yep, I definitely just fixed it. Thank God. Okay, I definitely just fixed it. Awesome. Mm-hmm. Okay, but this one's still like ultra perfect. Oh well, I'm gonna have to shave you down a little bit, eyebrow, so you can match your sister. Me when I mess up. <laughs> I love doing my eyebrows. I love doing my eyebrows and waxing. I love waxing. Waxing. AJ, stop saying that. No, you say be quiet. Up. You don't say shut up, baby. Up. And yeah, my baby says shut up because he learned that from his siblings while they were here. They were telling each other to shut up, and now he says shut up. And that's also very normal when you have kids. They learn from each other, good and bad habits, and it is what it is. Am I going to beat his ass because he's saying shut up? No. I'm just going to keep telling him to not say that. He's a toddler. And it seems like the more you tell toddlers not to do something, they want to do it. So sometimes I just ignore him. So he doesn't, like, think, ooh, I'm going to keep saying it so mommy gets mad. You know what I mean? Because that's how he is. Yeah. So anyway. 
that I know someone's going to be like, oh my god, her kid is saying shut up. But it's, it's not a big deal. It happens. It happens, mommies. Just a little bit more. even though I really like the shape of this eyebrow. <sighs> the more you pay attention to him, the more likely uh, is he's he'll do it. Yeah, 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 yeah. They love that attention. Yeah, exactly, exactly, girl. Yeah, because the more I tell him to not say it, he keeps saying it. Then if I just ignore him. Then he'll just stop. I don't know. Toddlers are funny. And something... Toddler boys. Oh, my God. Especially AJ. Like, AJ is so different from Christian. Christian was, like... A piece of cake compared to AJ. And that's okay. They're different people. You know what I mean? AJ is just, like, way more, like outspoken and just like you know he's I don't know but like Christian it was different with Christian Christian was a crybaby too but like Christian wasn't allowed to be a crybaby like if he would cry and stuff like Gerard would be like Gerard would like pinch him or like I don't know like it was he had he couldn't really be a cry baby like that. So yeah. My poor baby. But I let him be a crybaby now. You have to let your sons express themselves. I feel like that's a big thing for boys. I feel like when they're when they're little, like people like they just grow up to think like number one, like they can't cry they can't act a certain type of way because if they do they're looked at a certain way and I like get a lot of that vibe from Christian so it's like when Christian is with me Christian is like the biggest baby with me and I just like let him I just let him I think that's important Okay, I'm done. I'm done. It's as good as it's gonna get. In that way, when our sons are older, they can express themselves, you know what I mean? Like they'll be able to when they have a woman, they'll be able to like be sensitive and they're not gonna be emotionally unavailable and weirdos and, you know, think it's weird to cry around a female. Like, no, baby, express yourself. Don't always be like a big ass cry baby though. Like you need to pull it together. But I don't know, just let them be them. Why did you get loyalty tatted on you? Um, because I wanted to. Obviously. Why are you in my chat? Okay. I love it, I love it, I love it. Uh, I swear, can nobody wax me or tweeze me? Like, get me some yellow? The way I get myself together. I will like never let another person wax me again. I want to start waxing my own, which I will. I'm going to start doing that next. I won't go live and do that though, <laughs> for obvious reasons, but I want to start doing that. Uh, okay, thank you for the follow, baby. I love when you say it. When I say what? And after I wax, 
Some people put like oil, like you can put like like a vitamin E oil or something like soothing to the skin. My face does not like oils. My body likes oil, but my face doesn't like oil. So I put alcohol. If I put oil, I'll break out immediately on my face. So I have to put alcohol and it just like, I don't break out or nothing and it's good. You have to know your body. You know, like earlier I, I shaved my you know what? And I put alcohol because my kitty cat, whatever you want to call it, it's sensitive like my skin, like my face on my skin, like my skin on my face, <laughs> like my face on my skin. <laughs> so like I have to put alcohol down there after I shave just so like, you know, I don't get no bumps or nothing like that. I used to get razor bumps when I shaved down there. I think a lot of people do get razor bumps. But if, that's a hack, if you put alcohol on there after you shave it, alcohol is worse. So I don't know why you would do that. A lot of people say that. A lot of people tell me that. They're like, you put alcohol? Like, isn't it burn? Da, 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 da. It's not good for your skin. It's, it's okay. I don't know. Not everything everybody says is the truth, honey. You have to see what works for your body. Or you can use coconut oil. Yeah, I can't. If I put coconut oil on my face right now, I'll wake up with a bunch of bumps. Uh-uh. But if I put coconut oil on my arms or my legs or my stomach, you know, like other places in my body, I'm not going to break out. But if I put it on my face and say I put it down there, no, I'll get bumps. I'll get bumps. Mm -mm. My skin, my sensitive areas don't like that. I just put some alcohol. But yeah, if you guys get razor bumps down there when you shave, just put some alcohol on it. It works, I promise you. You won't get no bumps. So anyway, let me go. I love you guys. I'm gonna go get my babies together. These fucking teenagers. Oh, I can't wait for school to start. Thank you for the heart puff, baby. Thank you. What shaving cream do you use? I don't use shaving cream, actually. I use um, whatever soap. Oh, you use Nair? Yeah, Nair, I can't use Nair. Where do you get your biker shorts? I get them, well, these are from Skims, but these are like super old. They're just like boy short briefs type. I don't know, these are old as hell. I bought them a long time ago, I never wore them. And now they're like super loose on me, they're super big. But um, Nair stinks. <laughs> it does stink, but it works. It works for some people. Um, but Nair doesn't work for me. My skin doesn't like Nair. But um, I don't use shaving cream. I use whatever soap that I'm using. I just go with the soap. Shaving cream is too much. It's too much. It's, it's all over the fucking place. Mm -hmm. Maybe if I wasn't in the shower and I needed to shave, but I would still just use soap. I'll still just use soap. But I feel so good. It feels so good once you shave and everything because... Mm -mm. Okay, so tomorrow. I guess I'm not going to do my nails tonight. I'll do my nails tomorrow. I'm going to do my toes and my fingers. We're going to go with white toe. Oh, no. We're going to do French tip toes and we're going to do nails. So I'll be back on tomorrow to show you guys what that's like before we go out. Hi, Booty. You still eating your lollipop? Can I have some? Oh, AJ, it's so gooey. It's good, though. It's yummy. Yummy. He has it, like, so, like, gooey. Because you've been sucking on it, dude. Is your lollipop good? Yeah. My baby looks so handsome with his, with his haircut. I wasn't going to show you guys till the vlog, but I'm going to show you. Look at my papa. Got a fresh fade. Show him the fade, son. Show him the fade. Maybe got a big old head. Isn't he cute? I need to put him in modeling. Look how damn cute he is. My son is so fucking cute. Okay. You're adorable, kid. You know that? your handsome self got that fresh fade okay i see you baby 
anyway y'all I love you guys so much and I'll see you guys I know he's my twin and when I took him to the barber shop everyone was like like the guys there they were like oh my yeah. god that's your twin say bye <laughs> alright you guys I love y'all thank you guys for watching thank you to all my gifters thank you to all my double tappers shout out to y'all we bring in loyalty gang, 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 gang over gang. to TikTok. Soon we're gonna be loyalty nation. TikTok. Okay, bringing over that loyalty gang over here. I love y'all though. We need to make like a like loyalty gang. <laughs> Let me shut up. Okay, I gotta go. I still have like a teeny, teeny, teeny little headache too. But I love you guys. And just remember, y'all, just be the best versions of yourself, okay? Yeah. Yeah. Be the bad that I know that you are, okay? Because yeah. we are all bad, okay? I love y'all so much. And you're beautiful. You know what? I got a comment today on my video. And somebody was like, somebody commented and they were like, oh, so this girl really thinks she's all that. Or they said she thinks she's beautiful. And somebody yeah. wrote... I love y'all. Y'all always defend me. I love y'all so much. And you guys were like, somebody was in the comments and they were like, yeah, she does think she's beautiful. And what's the problem? She doesn't need validation from you. She just, she knows it herself. When I seen that comment, I was like, oh my God, this is my people. Like y'all watch me, the ladies who get it, get it. And I thought about that comment. And I was like, that's right. It don't matter who tells you what. And that's what I'm always preaching. And I'm just so happy that somebody else said it in my comments. And it don't matter what you look like, where you come from, none of that. If you think you're the baddest, you don't need nobody's validation to know who you are. And that is my message forever. Like, know who you are yourself and, and be ten toes down in that all the time. And just love yourself, ladies love yourself so much i know i talk a lot of shit and i know i go back and forth with a lot of ladies and that's because bitches come for me first okay i really don't be trying to come for people because deep down i really do think women are up here okay us women females born with vaginas oh we're up here god anointed us okay we are goddesses period and we're all beautiful in our own unique way we're gorgeous we're beautiful we're perfect in our own way and i just want every woman to know that like you need to know and i don't care i'm using that word perfect because we are perfect they say nobody's perfect no we are all perfectly who we are and that's the beauty of it so anyway, I don't know. I just love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. And I love y'all ladies too. Just know who you are and love yourselves first. Period. Okay. All right, you guys. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye. I love you, Ladybug. Thank you for the hand heart. Okay, tell them bye-bye. Bye-bye. Say love y'all. Yeah, yeah. Go mwah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right, y'all. Bye, guys. Bye. <laughs> no, we got to let me know what you think about Liv texting this new gym guy. What do you think about AJ's haircut? And why now has she decided to actually take AJ to the barber instead of cutting it herself? Just let me know all of your thoughts and opinions in the comment section. Thank y'all so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I will definitely see you in the next one.